Can I love on you? Draws. I'm feeling different every day. I need mismatch colors. It'd be like what a hundred bucks for the back, mother. Nah, I want to be soft. Right oh, this is a long. I want the cushions. To, I want the cushions to be on zippers, though, too. 22. Where is she? I don't know. I think I'm a little harder for my bed. Let me see it. Do you like it? I don't know. He's trying to decide right now whether he likes the foam. We got three and two. So much, there's too much stuff here. Anything you need. Take a minute. You in there? me every day getting high off this pub deal money or sitting back taking in what the world's got for me is so funny you got a right to right fast hoping that i never crash it's only been oh a year God. but i thought that this would never last be smile share a couple laps <laughs> i used to do the shakespeare competitions i just hope that they listen when i'm talking i hope they recognize me when i walk in i want the niggas to hear me way before they saw me i don't respond to every tweet i think that shit is corny but i'm showing out here at the big old phone factory we're gonna get some beds couches four beds and a couch so uh let's see what kind of phone there is Love foam, like you can jump into it, you can leap it, you can sleep in it. You can do so much stuff with foam. Uh, yeah. You want me to film you doing it? Oh. So Cameron gave me the the camera to come mess around with in the foam factory. And I think I'm in the employees only section, but Let's see what Cameron's up to. <laughs> Got 66,000 miles. I'm about to rebuild the whole thing. I have to pay now. <laughs> there you go. I'll probably be back here. Can we just see your ID real quick then, please? 627 for all the foam on the bed. Wait, there's gotta be a discount on it, a little bit. Okay, gotta try. <laughs> I got your camera. It's just a bunch of random. I don't know if you guys can see me, but it's fucking weird back here. There's a bunch of keys that right in front of me, right behind me. She said, straight through the doors. Right here, I think we're going right in here. Ooh, shit. They put this here? Huh? I already know I'm in the bathroom. I wonder if I should go upstairs. Fuck no, that shit's creepy. Got the humpy. Right 
Cameron, go. There he is. <laughs> Quick 20. Quick 20. In the works of getting a new, let's look at this trans van. Look at this green. It's shoe. different. We're gonna just gut it, rebuild it, travel. How uh, many miles on it say? 66,000. 66. This might not fit in your car, Doyle. That's not fitting. Bro, we're gonna have to stuff this thing in there. It's just foam. It's a van if we buy it. Squeeze. Well, we got some pieces of foam coming. We got four of these to fit in a nice view of Verano. No. They're gonna, he doesn't think so, but they will fit, I'm telling you. There's no chance. Get your mom up here. We still have two more. I don't want this. There's no way this is fitting in my car. <laughs> My whole car is, is so stuck. There's just one little hole. <laughs> and that one, I guess I'm going to have to sit with the other one. And the, oh, and the crutch? That ain't going to fit in there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, just watch how you make sure you don't rip it on the way out. Yep. <laughs> it barely shuts. There you go. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh, he definitely, you got a little hole back there, you can see. There's some headlights. But we're stuck, the trunk's even more stuck. <laughs> but the door's not even closed. But, dude, the whole car was rocking. Like, animals started because you want to push back. Are you pathetic? <laughs> Just got all the mattress pads in. The couch is looking pretty shabby. This is the wrong piece, I think, though. No. Let's see how all these mattress fits. They look pretty good. Pretty good. Here, let's slide this With one. With blankets and stuff in there. All right, you ready? You want to get here? You can go. Oh, the other one's landing way smoother. Oh, it's this piece. You can't feel anything. It feels like better than a normal bed. It is cooking in here. We definitely need the AC installed back there. Oh my god. Nice little man. square. Damn, the couch is really nice. It's too hot in here. Oh, there's a little hole. Oh, there's a little hole. What is up guys? It's the next day. I'm barely dressed, but we just got the foam. Literally just woke up, it's like 8.30. But we got the foam. I'm gonna go over all the foam. Test it out because I'm sitting on the couch right now. It's comfy. Comfy. Definitely worth the money. This one I got a little too tall. We'll try to use it for much smaller areas like the armrest right here. We'll try and add some foam, but the bunk beds came out perfect. The couch right here is going to need some modification because the couch I have is like an L. So it goes in a little bit. So we're going to have to get a turkey base or not a turkey baser. A turkey knife, like a bread knife almost, and cut it all right there and that's me spare because you have to buy it in a full sheet so this is the sheet that i needed that would fit it it's gonna need a little modification but it'll fit and then i'm thinking about adding an arm cushion on top of there because you don't want to just put your hand on some hard wood but we're gonna have a lot of left over from right here let's test out these uh It's a little hard, but we're gonna have some Tempur-Pedic padding on it. So it's gonna feel nice and plush. Definitely better than the other blankets we had. All four beds. So I built the beds with like, I guess it was like a th three inch, three inch little lip. So then like only an inch sticks out. So the mattresses don't like fly out, but not bad. 
Tempur-Pedic pad, a Tempur-Pedic pad, like a little egg carton one, or just a flat one. Probably be like an inch taller, but make it way comfier. All the blankets we used to use are all right here. We definitely roughed it a few times in this bus. It was cold, 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 like 20 degrees some of the times. I mean, that's cold for us. But uh, we slept on some plywood a couple times, so it's definitely, definitely a big, uh, big thing to get some mattresses for the beds. Riley got the cot, then we had these military mattresses. If you guys travel and this is a really good thing, they roll up super tight and they take like 20 seconds to blow up with your mouth. And they're pretty decent, they're pretty comfy. You got a little guy that just died living with us. Poor thing. Well, that was a nice, successful trip to the foam factory. I was always scared to get the foam because it, it was super pricey and you just can't return it if you mess up. So you couldn't mess up at all, but they all came out pretty good, super comfy. Oh, I forgot to tell you. This right here is super soft and this one's like high density. Uh, I think it's four inch, yeah, four inch. And that's like three inch, that's super soft. So you're leaning on something nice and plush. But I'm gonna go start editing this new video so we post it for over the weekend. All the cushions, like I said, came out excellent. Now we gotta find a way to wrap them. I'm not a sewer, I'm a builder. So we're gonna have to find someone to sew it. We're probably gonna end up figuring out how to do it ourselves. Cause you save so much money if you do everything yourself, like anything, you just gotta learn it. So, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, check out the other bus videos. We have a whole build thing and it's coming out pretty sick for a schoolie. So make sure you leave some support and some comments and everything. Thanks for watching. Part yep. one. So I said it before bus. and I'll say it again. Life moves pretty fast. You don't stop and look around once in a while, you could miss it.